This summer, Tampa will be introduced to a truly unique hotel experience. The Aloft Tampa Downtown, the boutique brand of Starwood Hotels and Resorts Worldwide, will open its doors to the public and offer its guests stylish comfort, forward-thinking technology, and a hotel in the very heart of the city. We were lucky enough to get a sneak peek of the construction. Jennifer Han, general manager of Aloft Tampa Downtown, is excited about what's coming. Well, the Aloft Tampa Downtown is a 130 room boutique property. It is very unique in its setting, being in the downtown area. It's uh, designed very urbanly, as you can see from what we're standing in. It's going to be the hippest, funnest, newest hotel in downtown. The Aloft Tampa Downtown is actually in its final construction phases. So it's doing a lot of finish work. We're working on, the air conditioning has actually come on. We're on full power. So it's, it's a lot of finish work. There's a lot of trades in the building. Um, up, up to upwards of about 80 people a day are working on this building. The guest rooms in the Aloft Downtown Tampa are very unique. We have, of course, our standard kings and rooms with two queens, but our eighth floor is unique in that it is all suites. Our presidential suite is over 950 square feet, and both sides of the building have balconies. This hotel has some great amenities for our overnight guests as well as our local um, guests. WXYZ Bar is a, is a big deal. We're standing in an area that is all so comfortable seating. We'll be featuring a lot of local artists for live music on weekends as well and during happy hour. Aloft Tampa Downtown is an exciting reuse project. Its developer, the Liberty Group, has been challenged to convert what was the old Mercantile Bank building into this sleek and stylish boutique hotel right along the Tampa River Walk. Poonit Shaw, CEO of the Liberty Group, is convinced that his company's efforts will result in a hotel that will be ideally suited for the Tampa market. It's a modern, unique lifestyle boutique brand that's geared to the Generation X and Y demographic. We picked this building in particular because it is the most centrally located building in all of downtown Tampa. It had its own challenges. It's a building that was built in the mid-60s, and it was never designed to be a hotel. It was designed to be an office building from its inception. So the type of challenges we faced were phenomenal, but well worth the location. The brand is really known for their technology and their access to that social environment and social media. We think that this hotel is going to be the most state-of-the-art hotel in Tampa. In fact, you can check in with your iPhone into any one of our rooms. You can walk into the hotel, go right to your door, wave your iPhone, and the door will pop wide open. Uh, we're the fastest internet in all of Tampa. Uh, the type of design we've put into the hotel makes us um, compatible to any technology changes over the next decade. So we're really excited about that, and we think that's going to tie in heavily into the demographic we're targeting. Where we're standing right now, we call it the backyard. And truly, it's the backyard for our guests. We've got a fire pit over there. We've got a incredibly difficult and, and challenging pool that was designed, but phenomenal views. The, the bar overlooks the pool, the gym overlooks the pool, the lobby overlooks the pool. So this is really going to be the nucleus of where the social activity of the hotel revolves around. When Aloft Tampa Downtown opens its doors this July, it will be the fifth Aloft Hotel in Florida. For Spotlight Tampa, I'm Mark Flynn.